Welcome to Around the World Channel. The Chinese version of TikTok now has 600 million daily active users, CNBC. TikTok logos are seen on smartphones in front of a displayed ByteDance logo in this illustration taken November 27, 2019. Chris Evans turns penis pic saga into bid to boost voter turnout, page 6. Chris Evans on Monday night reacted to his penis pic saga, turning the gaffe into an opportunity to boost voter turnout for the presidential election. Now that I have your attention. NFL Power Rankings. Should there be any concern about Jimmy Garoppolo and the 0-1 49ers? Yahoo Sports. Most Super Bowl teams have at least one bad game the next season. Sometimes it happens in week one. Maybe well look up at the end of December, maybe even the end of September, and the San Francisco 49er. Built to win now, Vegas Golden Knights, the West's top seed, failed to reach Stanley Cup Final, ESPN. Coach Peter Deboer was speechless as he walked into the Vegas Golden Knights dressing room on Monday after Game 5 of the NHL's Western Conference Finals. The latest on the coronavirus pandemic. Live updates, CNN. The woman's voice shakes as she recalls her quarantine days in a Venezuela motel. I sometimes am sleeping at night and I wake up thinking I am in the motel, she says, tearing up. Sally strengthens into Category 2 hurricane but moving slow. Three other systems active in the Atlantic, WFTV Orlando. Orlando, Florida 11 p.m. update. Sally is crawling at 3 miles per hour to the WNW and may slow down even further before turning to the north. Smoke from deadly wildfires in the west can be seen on other side of country, NBC News. Deadly and historic wildfires in the west are sending smoke as far away as the east coast, officials said. Dancing with the Stars, Carol Baskin performs Eye of the Tiger during season 29 premiere, Daily Mail. Carol Baskin performed to Eye of the Tiger on Monday during the season 29 premiere of Dancing with the Stars on ABC that featured a new host and a new judge, the 59-year-old big cat rights activist. Key impeachment witness Alexander Vindman said he now considers himself a never-Trumper, business insider, business insider. Retired Lieutenant Colonel Alexander Vindman, a key witness in President Donald Trump's impeachment inquiry, said he absolutely became a never-Trumper in light of the president's attacks against him. China's retail sales rise for the first time in 2020 CNBC. Beijing Chinese consumers stepped up their spending in August, in a sign of further economic recovery from the shock of the coronavirus pandemic. Retail sales rose zero. Please, like this video and subscribe to the channel if you want to stay tuned for upcoming news.